In this video, you will learn how to use the new calendar to keep track of important events and assignments. The calendar is meant for important events such as due dates. Be selective about the content you add to your calendar because a calendar that is too full loses its effectiveness and can be hard to read. Be careful not to use the calendar as a planning tool. For example, adding every topic you are going to cover in class when you teach or what students will be doing in class each day. There are other features in Canvas that might be better for posting this information, such as content pages, the syllabus, or modules. Also note that calendared dates will appear in the recent activity, to do, and coming up feeds to keep you and your students informed. Click Calendar in the global navigation to get started. Here you will see the calendar month with the events and assignments for all of your courses. In the sidebar, you will see the mini calendar and the calendars for your courses and groups. You can filter your calendar by courses or groups by clicking the color box next to the course or group name. You'll also notice a calendar with your name. This is your personal calendar where you can add events and reminders to help you stay on track. Change the view of the calendar to week or month or view the scheduler if enabled and use it to have students sign up for appointments. Be aware that not all institutions use this tool so you might not see this option. Click the arrows to view the previous or next week or month, depending on which you are viewing. To add an assignment or event to your calendar, click on the day or the plus icon at the top of the calendar. Then select either the event or assignment tab. Select the event tab to schedule a meeting, study session, test prep, etc. Select assignment to add an assignment that has a due date and involves a submission of some kind. Quizzes and discussions cannot be created from the calendar, but will appear on the calendar when they are created on their respective pages in your course. Also note that adding an assignment in the calendar automatically creates a gradebook column in the gradebook for that course. Give the assignment or event a name and add the date and time. Note that you can always change the name and due dates later. Select the appropriate calendar to which you would like to add the assignment or event. Be aware that you cannot move a calendar event from one calendar to another after it has been created, so make sure you add your event to the appropriate calendar, otherwise you will have to delete and re-add it to the right calendar. This is also the case with changing an assignment to an event, or vice versa. If you are adding an assignment and want to add assignment details, click More Options. You will be taken to the Assignment Details page. For more information on adding assignment details, watch the Assignment Creation video. Then click Submit. If you did not enter assignment details before submitting, your assignment shell will be saved and you can fill in the details later. Notice that the assignment you added to the calendar now appears on the Assignments page of your course. You can easily move the newly created assignment to a new date by clicking, dragging, and dropping. When you move an assignment to another date in the calendar, you are effectively changing the due date of that assignment. These changes will be immediately visible on the assignments page and on your syllabus. You can also subscribe to a calendar feed in iCal, Outlook, Yahoo, and Google. Click the calendar feed link at the bottom of your sidebar. Copy and paste the link into any calendar app that takes iCal feeds. For details on subscribing to the calendar feed in specific calendar applications, see the Canvas guides. You've now completed this tutorial video on the calendar. For additional information on this or any other topic about Canvas, just visit help.instructure.com. Also, if you have any feedback about this video, please share your thoughts at instructure.com slash video survey.